let's say you create a string like this string name one is equal to shivam this is called string literal and if you create it like this string city one is equal to new string delhi then this is called a string object both are stored differently in memory literal is stored in a special area meant only for strings called the string constant pool but a string object is stored in the heap memory as well as the pool name one points to the pool while city one points to the heap now the rule for string pool is that there can be no repetition of the same literal so if you create string name two is equal to shivam a new literal won't be created instead name two will point to the same location as name one however if you create another string object like string city two is equal to new string delhi then a new object will again be stored in the heap memory that's why city one equal to equal to city two returns false and name one equal to equal to name two returns true because the city variables point to the different locations in memory but both city one dot equal city two and name one dot equals name two return true this is because equals compares the values not the memory locations to understand this in more depth and answer string based interview questions watch the full video on my youtube channel